Uh, no end in sight to this heat wave that we're marching on through uh, the monsoon storm chances. They're in the low but not zero range. We've got the severe weather threat after today set to return to northeast New Mexico. Why is it so hot? I mean, this is always a hot time of year, but when the upper high is directly overhead, we usually get a few extra degrees out of our afternoon highs, and this is a very high upper high, so it's uh, even warmer than you know when we typically have one directly overhead, and that's producing these uh, numbers up near record values during the afternoon, well into the 90s, Santa Fe and Taos, another triple digit afternoon for Albuquerque. Uh, look at Crucis at 105, uh, Roswell 110 for the second day in a row, we think. Now areas along and south of I-40 is where we're going to see this best chance of scattered to isolated storms. Uh, Albuquerque in on the rain chance, but just barely. Uh, lower rain chance for Santa Fe. Uh, we are a step drier up towards Farmington and Durango. And uh, look at Durango up at 92 degrees. It's not enough for a heat advisory for you, but where we've got the triple digits, we do have heat advisories. They've been expanded since yesterday. Uh, Albuquerque, uh, it's going to be several more days of these all the way down to Las Cruces, uh, Roswell and Chavez County. That's an excessive heat warning. Uh, for those highs up around 110 uh, overnight tonight. We'll hold in the 70s in most spots here, at least central and southern New Mexico. Uh, 75 is the record for the warmest low temperature for the date. Uh, it'll be another morning where we give it a run for its money uh, tomorrow. Just a little bit further south and east push of the moisture, so it's a slightly lower rain chance, but it's not zeroed out. Got Albuquerque at 101 uh, Roswell at 108 tomorrow, so a couple degrees of heat easing uh, starting tomorrow. We're going to have to eye up northeast New Mexico uh, for some severe weather potential, and this is Friday. We push the a little bit further to the south and east, and I think that's going to be our hottest day of this stretch here, at least in the short term up at 103. We may get back up to that number next week. Friday, another day with that severe weather threat clipping northeast New Mexico. Here's that seven day forecast. Yeah, still filling it up with triple digits. Granted, there are a couple days where the forecast high is right around 100 degrees. Uh, that's today and Sunday. Uh, so we spike it Friday back off a little bit this weekend and then uh, maybe do some more 102s and 103s next week. Right now, it looks like next week will be another week where the forecast high will be 100 or more every day.